Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Sim Soup, and I'm going to do a Sims 4 High School Years LP. So it's going to be a short LP, I think. <laughs> we'll see where where it takes us. But yeah, I wanted to create a few teens, maybe three, and they're all going to be different personalities. So um, they're all going to like different things. And I wanted to kind of go through the high school experience through the expansion pack and find out what this pack has to offer so I just downloaded it and I'm ready to go um, but we do have this pop-up in the beginning when I get into the game uh, experience high school experience all the ups and downs of high school attend classes in person get to know your teachers hang out in the cafeteria and even decorate your locker and then we have iconic teen moments dance the night away at prom and celebrate your graduation ceremony with family and friends make lifelong friends participate in after-school activities and experience the roller coaster of puberty <laughs> uh, shake things up high school is a time of self-discovery find the confidence to ask your your crush out or the guts to skip class teens will explore their own likes and dislikes pranks and sneaking out after dark can have consequences so be careful you don't get caught explore your style make your bedroom your own plan outfits and become a simfluencer teens can earn money by selling outfits and hyping up looks they design on trendy right from their bedrooms which are now more interactive than ever that sounds like fun. I am really excited to start playing this uh, game pack, game pack, expansion pack, and seeing what it has to offer. So I'm going to actually go into cast. I'm going to create my sims, and I will show you guys who I create, and yeah, we'll go from there. So see you guys soon. All right, guys. So welcome back. Um, we are in cast right now, and I just created my family. So it took me a long time, but... I kind of made a little backstory about them and created them the way they are. So we have the mom here, Alessandra Craft. Um, so I didn't change much, pretty much. If she looks familiar, because she's from uh, one of the ones that pop up when we go into cast. Um, maybe I should take that hat off. But she's—I didn't really change her outfits too much. I just left her how she showed up. So yeah, I didn't really do much for her, but she is a fabulously wealthy aspiration seeker, so fortune, and she has a bonus trait of business savvy, um, so she's going to be worried about her career and making some money. She's cheerful, squeamish, and materialistic. <laughs> didn't think I could say that for a second there, but yeah, and she's a adult. Um, but that is the mom. Now she has three kids. So we have Julia Craft. Um, so her hairstyle and her outfit is actually from the new expansion pack, as you can see. So she has that everyday outfit. Her formals also, both hairstyle and the dress, is from the expansion pack. And then, oh athletic that shirt is from the new expansion pack sleepwear party wear the top is also new swimwear hot weather and cold weather I think that top is also new I have a rocker on there. Oh, yep, that's new. You can see some of the new ones on here. Um, but she is a cheerful and self-assured teen. Um, I have her as the aspiration for admired icon. Uh, this sim wants to be a trendsetter, popular and influential, a true icon. So I was curious um, to go down that path, so we're going down that path with her. Um, otherwise, there's nothing else really about her that I can tell you. Um, so we're going on to Heidi Craft. Um, new hairstyle, new outfit. That's her every day. Um, formal wear. So I gave her more of a pant leg 
type of style. I don't know, she has like all kinds of different styles going on. <laughs> but I don't think she fits into a mold per se. Um, her athletic wear, sleep, party wear, swimwear, hot weather. I think I just love that dress as is. And then cold weather. Um, she is socially awkward, so that's a oh. new trait that came with wow. the pack. Uh, these sims tend to struggle in social situations and build charisma more slowly, but gain powerful moodlets and sentiments when they are able to overcome their awkwardness and accompanying nervousness to form close relationship or friendships. And she's also an overachiever. I believe this one also came, I think? I'm not 100% sure. Uh, these sims tend to raise their skills faster and are happier when they finish work tasks, but are a little harder to get along with as friends. So she's going to have a hard time with relationships, but we'll do our best. Her aspiration is goal-oriented. This sim wants to be the best. Grades, check. Sports, check. Money, check. The road to success is being paved. <laughs> so she's going to be an overachiever. Um, I did give each of them some likes and dislikes, but you guys can see that when we're in gameplay. Uh, next, their brother, Romeo Craft, <laughs> original name. Uh, so that's his everyday. I think he's going to be like a fitness jock type of person. Uh, so that outfit's new. And his hairstyle's also new. His formal wear. Athletic wear. Sleepwear, party, swimwear, oh, he still has makeup on. You know what, we'll leave that on. <laughs> um, hot weather, and cold weather. Um, he is a cheerful and outgoing sim, and he has the aspiration of live fast. This sim aims to get the most out of life by living carefree and rules free. So he has an interesting one. It's gonna be fun. And each of them get this relatable um, hidden trait. Relatable sims build friendly relationships with fellow teens faster. And then we actually have our fourth teen and he's not part of the um, family. He is, but he isn't. Um, he wasn't um, he wasn't born from Alessandra, but she actually, um, he came along when her best friend passed away. So he's been growing up with the rest of the kids or teens. So he's part of the family. Um, so he is kind of like the brother and sister, um, siblings, but you know, um, technically he's a, he isn't, but he's more or less adopted and it was more recent. Um, so that's why it's a little... It's not as um, family cemented because he just came along recently. Um, but that's his everyday. That top is definitely from the new expansion pack. Um, he's going to have that rocker vibe. <laughs> um, his formal wear. Athletic wear. Sleep wear. Party wear. Swim wear. Hot weather, <laughs> I like the back to that. That's new, the top. Uh, and cold weather. Okay, so he is creative. Um, I wanted him to actually play the guitar and be a, a real rocker. <laughs> and he's also self-assured. Um, so he actually has the drama llama um, aspiration. I don't know if this fits that well, but this is the only one left, and I really wanted to do all four of them, so he's going to be the drama llama, um, but as a rocker. Uh, so yeah, he's the drama llama teen, um, but his name is Brendan Henderson, um, so he has a different last name than everybody else, but yeah, he, he is part of the family. Um, but otherwise, I think that's all I need to show you guys. I'm going to go in and we're going to take a look at the new town. So I will see you guys when we get there. Okay, so we are going to head into Copperdale right now. 
So this is my first look. Um, well, I, I saw the leak of the picture of the town, but <laughs> this is the first time I get to, you know, go in and have some fun. Um, but it looks like we have three neighborhoods. We have Rockridge Heights, home to Copperdale High. Rockridge Heights is the town's standard bearer for academ academia <laughs> across generations. It's a beloved school ground for quintessential teen moments and college preparation with classrooms full of learning and an auditorium full of prom possibilities. Rockridge Heights Heights is the perfect environment for every teen to discover who and what they want to be. Hmm. And we have Prescott Square. Um, named after Copperdale's founder, Jasper Prescott, this town square is quaint hub for all after-school hangouts. For the fashion for teens, Eloise Hendelsticks, <laughs> well-known thrift tea shop, is the spot to grab a bubble tea and explore the latest trends. Lakeview Library is perfect for academically-minded teens to squeeze in a cram sesh or find a study buddy, representing Copperdale's historic historical legacy this square is central to all the residents some say they've been they've seen the ghost of jasper lurking near his old dwelling the the booms bluff mystery house oh my gosh i don't know why that was so difficult for me to read i'm like reading ahead because i'm so excited <clears throat> okay and the third one is plumbite cove settled on lake lasuli sits plumbite <laughs> sorry guys plumbite Cove, a once popular location for its mining of rare gems, after the mines shut down, the town turned this picturesque outlook into a waterfront fairground with thrills, chills, and a breathtaking view. Plumbite Pier is the ideal spot for all ages to make some memories. Travel to Totter Park to see the majestic Teeter Rock be before heading to the pier to snag a selfie with the Frank the Flying Womp Womp tribute. Whether settling down or just stopping by, Plumbite Cove is a must-see Copperdale gem. So, goodness, that took me forever to read all of them. Um, so it looks like the only residential with uh, residential house with uh, yeah, <laughs> the only residential house. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying anymore. That's open is here. We do have a open lot here or clear lot i don't know I'm not sure if i want to build a lot or maybe I could download one from the gallery but maybe we can take a look at this house and try to squish everyone in there because there's, there's only two bedrooms and there's a bunch of us there's going to be lots of bunk beds so um yeah let's head into this house here and see what we can do furnished let's let's go Okay guys, we have entered the house. Um, I did go in to buy mode and added these bunk beds in here. It's a tight squeeze, but hopefully they don't glitch out. Um, but they're there and, you know, everyone go can go to sleep, thankfully. <laughs> um, but otherwise, uh, yeah, so we have this house. So this is the house we moved into for now. Um, I don't know if we're going to expand, we're going to move into a new house, but it'll happen later on. Um, but it's quite nice. It's nice and tiny and perfect starter home. So that's where we're, this is where we're living for now. Um, our setting is quite nice. Um, we're right by the beach here. Some little ducks, I think and the water looks very nice and then we have our view of the amusement park right next to us so this is exciting t as well um i can't wait to come and visit and you know see how my, the sims interact with the uh with the place but oh i love the haunted house um that was one of my favorite things from sims 3 so i can't wait to try that out but otherwise, yeah, very scenic area. It's very nice. Um, but heading back, so first thing I noticed, uh, the calendar was glowing when I first came in. And we actually have these new activities. 
So there are festivals, football team sports day. So there's that. The next day is cheerleading team sports day. And then Saturday is prom. So everyone's going to prom on that day. So it looks like that's all happening Thursday, Friday, Saturday. The next week, it's the same thing. So I'm guessing every week it's going to be the same routine. Um, but that is going to be exciting. Some of the teens can participate in these uh, festivals. So we're going to have to remember to go and see that. Also, another thing I noticed is when I click on the phone, <laughs> we have this uh, new interface for the phone. So I also wanted her, hold on, social bunny, trendy, we're going to try that, entertainment, shopping, home, travel, business, social, and camera, and this is just my wonderful whims mod. Um, let's check out this social bunny, ooh, open social bunny, turn off notifications, deactivate social bunny, let's open, whoa, okay, so... We can start posting things and fun stuff like that. Tag Sim, new post. Oh, that's so cool. Welcome to Social Bunny, a place to connect with other Sims and virtually share your life to get started. Use the button below to add friends. Let's see if we can do this. Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> that was too quick. I was trying to add all of them at once. Um, share your experience now that you've added friends share your experience and interact with those social bunnies using the following features post something tag someone send a message okay let's see and try to add our family perfect and there and then we can add our friends once we start getting friends Messages, build relationships, let other social bunnies know what's hopping, reach out to contacts via messages, be warned, words have consequences. Okay. Starting some events to post about. So we have to experience some things to post. Okay. Make a new tag post. Let your social bunny followers know what is on your mind. How do you feel about it? Friendly message. Flirty message. <laughs> slide into those DMs when Cupid's arrow needs a bit of help finding its target. Oh my goodness. Funny message. Mean message. Okay. I guess we have to pick someone. Let's pick our mom. I feel like Alessandra has it all figured out. Moral support or advice. They got your back. Aww. What's this? Oh my goodness, the emojis. I, I love it. Okay, <laughs> that's enough of that for now. Okay, so once we start finding more people, we can have fun with that. Oh, and we, I also wanted to try this trendy app. About trendy, browse trendy, check followers. About trendy see what this is okay about trendy and fashion looks thrifty go visit thrifty to hunt for your next fashion look you can also talk to the owner about which trends are hot right now trendy you can create fashion looks in thrifty and sell them on trendy you can also buy other listings hype them and sell those too trends and hype every fashion look belongs to a trend wearing and promoting a fashion look increases its hype level as well as making that trend more popular followers successfully hyping and selling fashion looks will gain followers more followers increases your success when selling on trendy cool um browse trendy let's see maybe we can do that with one of the kids oh Aggravating conversation. It was nice meeting you today. We met someone? <laughs> okay. Um, Vlad Strahd. <laughs> what is he selling? Artisanal effect. The statement piece of an outfit comes with a cute pink long sleeve jacket paired with a beautifully artistic mural drawn on light blue jeans and pink canvas shoes. <laughs> I like this description. It's boho trend. Nina Caliente. This outfit is designed to give off peaceful and comfortable vibes. It comes with a cute, frilly white top and a beige skirt and a beige shoes. 
Interesting. Dina Caliente. You guys can read that description if you'd like and pause it. But I'm going to continue. Coffee shop. Okay. Crooner. My goodness, there's so many. Ooh, dark. Academia. Prep. Modern. Dress for success. Fuzz taste. Great outside. Lofi. <laughs> Made to last, Bella Goth, <laughs> Mountain Peak. This is so cool. Rough Diamond, Planet Town. Wow. Thrasher. Oh my goodness. That is really cool. All right, let's head out of here. We don't really, we shouldn't be spending any simoleons at this time. Have you been, go away. <laughs> Social Bunny. Oh wow, it's so cool. I like it. It's cute. Wait, how do we... I don't know. Let's have him also add everyone. There we go. I might need more time. I don't know who she's talking to right now. People just call a classmate? Cool. Um, so maybe for this first part, we can head out to one of the locations and check it out in town. Don't tell anyone what we talked about. We can talk about it more at school. Oh, I love it. So wait, Charity is starting to meet people and she didn't really meet them yet. That's cool. Oh man, this is addictive. <laughs> oh my goodness, that's so cool. Hold on, so she know. Um, oh, we're on Heidi's. Whoops. Let me see, so. Okay, no. I guess technically not. I guess we have to know each other better. Why don't we all head out somewhere? Also, I put um, Ella, Alessandra in a career. And I have her in regional manager, so we're going to have to work on our logic skill. Um, otherwise, I think we should head out. Oh my goodness, this gets really addictive trying to go back and see what's going on. Alright, so we have to travel. First time using this as this interfa interface. Um, let's travel all together. And we're going to head out to one of the locations in town and check it out. So we have a residential house, Prescott, family of the founders, I guess. Um, also, some Sims, auditorium, the high school. Can't wait to go check that out. Hillside Haven, that's a rental. And Totter Park and the Price family. So I wonder if we can just walk over to the amusement park. Or right there. I no. Let's actually let's check out let's check out the Thrift Tea Tea Store. I'm really interested in that one. So we're gonna head over to there. So see you guys there. All right, we've made it. So this is the place. It's cute. Okay. Oh, look at this little guy. Cool. Um, so I guess we can have somebody order maybe a drink. Okay, so we got some bubble tea um strawberry matcha latte bubble tea that sounds interesting these two run the shop together thrifty owner and barista they are very cool and hip you wish you were like them but you're not no matter how hard you try how sad oh my goodness all right let's order that drink dance skill oh they're already looking through the clothes cool 
Why are you embarrassed? Cringy stream. Hmm. Create a fashion one look. Hmm. Ooh. Yeah, we already took a look at this before. Create a fashion look. Let's see. All right, she got her bubble tea. Exciting. Looks mushy. <laughs> Wonder how she likes it. And we're meeting some new people as well. Oh, that's the thrift store owner, Eloise. Maybe we can uh, make a cheerful intro introduction. Fashion browser, Dominic, okay. Ooh, Bubble Bunch from Drinking Bubble Tea. Alessandra loves being in the company of like-minded, oh god, tapioca, <laughs> tapico, <laughs> just like S-pop, I guess, if that's how you feel. Um, ball beverage enthusiast, how do you say that word? Tap, tapico, tight, oh my god, I'm gonna stop there <laughs> before I embarrass myself. This is, the social bunny is addictive. Goodness, I want to keep checking because it keeps popping up. Um, I wonder if any teens will show up. I don't know. There's a child. What's the scenery? Looks looks like a little town. And then there's the ocean. There's a nice gazebo. It's cute. It's a very nice town. It's a nice scenery. This town actually reminds me of uh, Pennsylvania. That's the state I live in. <laughs> and this town is very similar. Aesthetic and look to it. All right, who can we meet? We gotta add some people on our social bunny. Um, he's still mad. Ash. Hi, I'm Ash. Welcome to Copperdale. I'd love to give you advice about the cool things to do around here, like hitting up Plumbite Pier. Do you mind if I check over the next few days to see how you're sitting in? Yes. <laughs> block. <laughs> I won't block this number. Sounds good to me. Jeez, you need to get unmad. <laughs> Not my tempo. The battle begins from extrovert nearby. So, I guess he's actually an introvert. Interesting. Let's look at their aspirations. Um, so he's the live fast aspiration. Um, it says to pull prank three times, get in trouble, sneak out to a party. Okay. Gonna have to do that when we go to school. Um... She is the admired icon, so join a tea post challenge, huh, make 10 teen friends, post on social bunny five times, okay, goal oriented, join an after school activity, I wonder if we can do that at home, uh, do homework five times and earn fi 500 simoleons, We're gonna get her a job maybe, and drama llama. Gossip five times, spread a rumor, and mess around in the cuddle carts. I think this is fine. I think the aspiration actually matches him um, being his personality. So I'm excited to start completing these aspirations and having some fun. Is there any teens popping up? I feel like it's all adults and some children. All right, can we actually buy clothes? Like, doesn't seem like we're able to do that. Ooh, there's a computer here. Hold on, let me see if I can see if there's anything new here. University, social networking, household. Okay, high school. <gasps> Join an after-school activity. Graduate early. 
Okay. And drop out of high school? I didn't know you can do that. That's cool. Maybe we can have one of our children drop out. Maybe not. I don't know. We'll see. I don't really want any of them to drop out, but you never know what happens. Okay. So we have cheer team member Go Copperdale Flying Womp Womps. Join the competitive cheerleading team to leave oh my god leave level up on fitness and learn some amazing cheer moves practice with your squad and compete at the cheer competition once a week you'll need a cheer mat to get started but re reach cheer captain to earn a golden cheer mat team flag and trophy so Heidi's not um gonna be cheerleader I think chess team member join the high school chess team put your logic skills to the test by joining this activity and meeting teammates that you can enchance your chess playing skills with by joining this activity you'll be able to request a high school science fair where you'll get to participate in chess puzzle with other guests guests <laughs> build your way up to captain where you can earn a special chess table a team flag and a trophy hmm hmm computer team member Get out that RGB keyboard and join the high school computer team. Work on your coding experience by practicing programming on a computer. If you join this activity, you'll be able to request a science fair. So same thing as the chess team. Make your way up in the team to reach captain level where you can uh, earn a golden laptop, team flag, and trophy. Drama club, that's from before. Football team member, join the football team and level up on fitness. You'll be able to practice football throwing and catching performance that you can show off at the sports day festival. Along with football practice, you'll be able to reach captain level position and earn a golden football team flag and trophy. Okay, so for Heidi, it's either I'm thinking computer team member or chess team member. Um... I'm not sure if I want her to go into programming. I mean, she could. But chess team, I feel like your logic skills, they'll bring them up. And she, I think, would be leaning more towards that rather than computer, computer team member. So I'm going to make her a chess team member. So let's do that. Also, it's from 3.30 p.m. to 5.30 p.m. Okay. Chess team fresh recruit. Sounds good to me. So, enter the chess team member career. Nice. Okay. I am going to get all of them to join. Join the after school activity. She's going to go join the cheerleading, I think. Cheer team. Yeah. Um, I don't think I'm... Yeah. Okay. Let's do that. And that's also 3.30 to 5.30 p.m. Monday, Wednesday, Thursday. Julia just got a cheer mat in her household inventory. Enter the cheer team. Um, I was going to say, Brendan, I don't think is going to join a team. He's uh, in his own world. <laughs> He's going to be busy with other things, maybe. <laughs> Able to follow more messages. Cool. Okay. And he's going to be a football team member. Also 3.30 to 5.30. All right. Romeo just got a football in his inventory to practice with, and he joined the team. All right. Sounds good. Okay. Um, maybe we can order some food. So it looks like we get veggie sliders, fried chicken slider, hamburger slider, and corn dog. I'm gonna get him hamburger slider maybe. That's my jam. <laughs> All right, so we're getting somewhere. Okay, one more time. I want to check. <laughs> There's nothing happening. Why is it telling me this? Can we add anyone else? Oh, we got a new one. Moira. Sure. Did anyone else come here? Any teens? I don't think so. Why don't you come greet? Oh, never mind. All right. So. All right. Everybody's hungry, and he's not ordering anything. 
Maybe we can just head home now and let them make dinner. So let's head home. Shopping, social. So wait, what's sh social? Interesting, okay. All right, let's travel back home. So I will see you guys when we get back home. All right, so we made it back home, but I am going to end the part here um, just because I uh, don't want to make the part too long now. <laughs> and the next part will be coming out soon. Uh, I think I'm going to record it here and then upload it maybe in another day um, but I think in the next part we're gonna hang out at the amusement park see how that goes and we're also gonna have our first day at high school so that is exciting um, but yeah so if you guys are interested you know look out for the next part um, but thank you for watching I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll talk to you guys soon bye mm -hmm.